The Alaska native village of Shishmere, an island near the Bering Strait, is home to about 600 people. Unfortunately, the land is rapidly shrinking. What used to be hundreds of feet away from the coast, from the ocean, are now getting, as that coastal erosion happens, the villages are getting closer and closer to the ocean to the point where waves are breaking through the communities. And when there's a big storm coming in, um, a surge happens. So any kind of increase in sea level is just going to exacer exacerbate the problem and make it even worse for Alaska communities. Due to increased storms, a lack of sea ice and melting permafrost and continued coastal erosion, the close-knit island community has voted twice to relocate, first in 2022 and again in 2016. I voted for relocation because I see a big difference around this island where humans, you know, we as humans will try our best to save it, but uh, we're not going to, it's not going to be enough. But due to the high cost of relocating the whole village and wanting to preserve their traditions, such as subsistence hunting and gathering, they remain in the village. Hunters like James Kakuna sees the difference in the land and fear his way of life is being changed. Hunting for the subsistence food, which includes seal, walrus, fish, reindeer and caribou, has become harder due to lack of ice in the fall, winter and spring seasons. A lot of us hunters, we see the difference after climate change. Molly Snell, a mother and lifelong Shishmaref resident, has heard the stories and fears of climate change her whole life. While she doesn't believe relocation will happen in her time, but for the safety of her children and grandchildren, she hopes they do relocate before a storm forces them to evacuate. But for now, the resilient residents are carrying on, celebrating milestones and honoring traditions.